So over here, you can see that I got a bunch of video clips that I have edited. And let's say I want to export this out now. So in order to export it out, over here on the top right hand side, you can see scene right here. So you can choose your uh, dimensions over here. And then you can go around over here and select the start and end frame. So I'm just going to go around and pull out this area right here. And once I do that on the dope sheet, you can see that as I move the cursor, you can see the number of frames. So it's 120 frames. So uh, I'm going to go around and type in that the end frame is 120. You can go around and select the frame rate as you wish. So I'm just going to select 25 frames per second. And then over here at the bottom, you can select out the output directory as you can see. So I'm just going to go around over here and then I'm going to save this out into um, the TutorTube drive inside uh, of a videos folder right here, just like this. I'm just going to accept this. And over here, you can also select out the file format. So I'm going to select FFMPZ video right here so that the, it comes in video format. I'm going to expand this out and select um, S.264 as the video format. You can also go around and select the quality of the video right here and select audio if you have audio right here. So you can select AAC right here for the audio. And similarly, you can go around, select out different things as you can see. So now I've selected out the videos over here as well. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start uh, rendering this out. And to do that, you can go around into render and you have to click on render animation. So once you do that, what happens is that the video gets rendered out. So depending on how much effect you actually have, this might take some time. So now it has been rendered out as you can see. So this is what you have. So I'm going to open up my computer right here onto my YouTube drive right here. So videos is the folder that I have. And then there you go. This is the video as you can see. So if I were to double click on this, the edited video has now been converted and exported as a video as you can see. And that is how you can export out edited videos inside of Blender. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.